Hi everyone, nice to see you again. Ha ha ha. Um, I want to tell you a quick story about how I'm feeling right now um, with the world and everything. So I went to this pretty cool uh, college, University of Portland. Nice school, um, great teachers. Man, just had the best time there. I was a pretty good student. Always ready, you know, for anything. Uh, did my work, but I can remember a couple times where I wasn't ready for class with the assignment. And so, you know, I, I got there and I'm like, man, what's going to happen? You know, I'm not ready. So, um, but right away, it felt like the, um, the class wasn't ready for some reason. Like students were complaining, things were coming up in the assignment and da, 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 da. Well, lo and behold, the teacher like postponed it, right? She said, okay, well, I'll give you you know, a couple more weeks to do it or something because, you know, you guys don't seem ready. So I just benefit benefited from that right away. You know, I was like, oh, cool. You know, I, I wasn't ready either. I wasn't going to complain, but I wasn't ready. So that was just like, you know, a cool thing to happen. So right now, that's kind of how I feel about life, which is weird. It's like, I'm not ready for it. I can't, I couldn't, even if I try to, like, I'm doing this other thing. I'm following this other path right now and my assignment's not ready. So I feel like the world like stopping and everybody's is this like, they're all like, well, let's just postpone this because we're not ready. Well, I'm not ready. And I, I kind of feel like happy about that. And I'm, I'm scared for a lot of people and it's just a horrible situation. And I hope y'all are okay. And just, you know, be careful out there. Use your common sense and we'll get through this together. But I'm like working on another assignment right now, so I'm not even thinking about that. Just trying to, you know, stay safe myself. So, um, but what I wanted to say is that tomorrow's my first chemo um, therapy session, and um, I'm looking forward to it. You know, I've already heard a lot of people say different things about how it feels and everything, and I'm just kind of, you know, ready for whatever. So, um, just pray for me. I keep saying pray for me, but what what I mean when I say pray for me is just uh, you can pray, you, you can sing, you can dance, you can meditate um, for that positive energy, you know, that people give out into the world and just send that positive energy out there and I will I will get some of it, you know. So even if you all you do is just breathe, you breathe and, um, you know, I will feel it and a lot of people will too that we need you know that positive energy because that's all we are is light and energy and and I feel that and I try to do that all the time and uh just take care out there and I think the last thing I want to say is that um you guys are just you know amazing and you're taking care of each other and I really like to see that um I'm using Facebook because I'm I have a lot of time on my hands and my kids are going to be fine. You know, there, <laughs> there's been, uh, you know, brilliance that comes out of, you know, um, tragedy and despair and everything. So your kids are going to be fine. You know, we're going to be fine and they're still going to be smart and they will still be able to read. <laughs> so they'll be okay. Just, you know, do what you do as a, as a mom, as a dad as an aunt, as an uncle, and just love them, listen to them, and um, just play. You know, that's all we can do is play, because soon the internet will be down. <laughs> and then, like, it comes out, you know, we remember who we are as people. So, you just take care of yourselves out there. I love you guys, and um, I'm just going to keep sending out positive energy to the world, okay? Take care. I'll talk to you tomorrow if I can. Alrighty, bye-bye.